To continue with our unboxing, let's turn our LG Optimus 7 handset on and see how long does it take to set it up the phone. And okay, it's on and let's let's start. What we get is first we first we get some Windows Phone 7, Microsoft Legal, blah blah blah, so of course I accept that. Then it, we can choose Windows Phone settings, it's either either recommended or custom, let's do custom. And here we have a, a, a question of whether we want to use mobile data on our, or on, on our phone, or, of course. I want to use the data and do I want to send the information to help improve the Windows Phone? Well, not at the moment. Okay, the next step is choosing the time zone for the phone. And my time zone is Helsinki Kiev Vilnius. Next. And now I'm setting the date. Today is November. 20, oops. It's November and now it's 22nd of November. Yep, that's it. And the time is 5 p.m. So, yep, it's here. And we have 5 past 5 right now. Okay, here we go. The time is set. And the next step is sign in with the Windows Live ID cannot do that because uh, the the sim card in this phone is not for the default network that it was that was pre-configured in factory actually I'm not in the Windows Phone 7 supported countries at all and so I'll have to first set up uh, my internet connections manually and uh, so let's go further and say and tell him the phone not now and well that's it all done and phone is LG Optimus is set up and ready to be customized and to be run. As LG uh, Optimus 7 launches to run for the first time we get we got a welcome message from Windows Phone 7 OS and what it's telling us that directing us to the five hot tips uh, <coughs> about uh, the operating system unfortunately as i said the internet connection is not yet ready and <coughs> to, to run so first we have to set up an internet and for that we go to settings and choose mobile network and here i the data is on connection 3g is on and then i have to add the apn for my mobile network manually here we go that's on and that's about that's it I have a I should have already have an internet connection let's check it out yep what a phone start page in my browser is already loading so I do have 3G HSDPA connection from uh, through my mobile operator another thing I want to add is um, Wi-Fi connection because I don't want you to use too much data when I have the ability to connect to my home network Here we go to the settings and Wi-Fi and This is my home network. All I have to do now is enter Password Done And here we go now I'm connected to, to Wi-Fi to my home network as well. Well, with the internet and data connections up and ready to go, the next step is to set up the contacts my and uh, my people's hub, where all my contacts are. The first step is to import SIM, SIM contacts and uh, here yeah, I'm importing it because all my most important contacts are K 
kept uh, on the SIM card because when because if I have a new phone and I don't have the data connection, I still have ability to contact all of them. And of course, uh, my main phone phone book with all the contacts is backed up somewhere in the cloud through several services, and I can access that whenever I have data connection. And let's get back. Here we go, and uh, the people are already telling me that I, I should also set up my Facebook account. Yep, here it is. So I enter my Facebook login. Oops, sign in. Well, basically that, and that's what it takes to have the Facebook. Uh, account to connect it to my people people's hub on lg optimus 7 here we go all the latest uh, friend status updates are already here and also as you can see the phone already started adding the contact the, the, for my friend contact data from facebook together with all the photos and other information that my friends on Facebook are, are sharing. So here we go, people, oh, my people hub is set up. And now we go to the next step and the next step would be setting up email accounts. And here we, there is an email set up dial on my phone and Okay, what I will do is I will set up my an unwired view one of unwired view email email accounts which is which are running on Gmail and Google Apps. For that what I have to do is I have to enter my Google account email address and I pressed sign in, sign in, and here we go. It's already synchronizing and downloading messages. Yeah, it takes a little bit to, to download those messages, but not too long since they have pretty fast so, Wi Fi connection. Okay. Uh, up and running as you see the uh, the lg optimus 7 downloaded 100 new email messages if i want to check them i'll just go here i'll check them i get back and now it's clear so the next step is customizing uh, the home screen and by adding some of the contacts i'm, I'm, I'm calling the most and making them to the home page so I can access them very quickly. Let's for example take my wife Here we go. Here's the her mobile data. What I want to do first is uh, to connect her mobile uh, contact data from SIM card to her data on Facebook and for that I'll just do Facebook search. Yeah, here it is and uh, now this uh, her contact data from Facebook and from my SIM card are connected into one data profile and okay here we go as you can see now you can I can see the picture and then I long press on that I get an option to pin to start press it and her con her, she is already on my home screen what I want to do next is move her even closer to my to the contact and here we go I'll just move it to this place yeah it looks a little bit messy with this empty space here so what I have to do is to delete one tile yeah this one I don't need this is 360 Vodafone my web services and since I'm not on Vodafone network I have no need for that so just press on it and delete and then I move this one up here and yeah there is here we have my custom customized home screen with the one where I can easily call my my wife with a single click 
here we go. We already have uh, LG Optimus 7 Windows Phone set up and pretty well customized with um, the connection to my Facebook account, account uh, with the, one of my email accounts up there and also well, the, the contacts that I'm calling the most moved uh, to the front page and also uh, the contacts uh, that I that they wanted uh, my from uh, from their <coughs> sim card and from the data from the state facebook merged into a single record and only one click away from the from the call the whole process of uh, setting up the phone setting up internet connections email accounts facebook accounts and merging one of the records it, it took me uh, about 10, 10 minutes so what, can, what I can say is that LG Optimus 7 Windows Phone, I was pretty my, pretty surprised by the, the easy, ease of use of this handset and uh, the new Windows Phone 7 operating system. And uh, the whole set, setup process uh, and getting the phone up and running with some customi customization was one of the easiest uh, that I encountered uh, with the all among the most of the among the all all the smartphones uh, that i do te do test and have tested before before that